Hello! Welcome to the Tech Master channel. In this video, I want to teach you how to install and set up WinLater on Android, so stay with me until the end of the video. Ever wanted to play your favorite PC games right on your Android phone? Yeah, me too! That's actually why I started working on WinLater, to make Windows gaming possible on Android. Imagine running your favorite Windows apps and games without needing a bulky, power-hungry laptop. Pretty cool, right? Let's check it out. So what exactly is WinLater? Basically, it's this awesome emulator that lets you run Windows apps and games right on your Android device. It uses a mix of tools like Wine, Box86, and Box64, which means it can handle both older x86 games and newer 64-bit ones. And the best part? You don't even need a gaming PC for this. As long as your Android phone or tablet has a Snapdragon chip, just a heads up, Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 isn't supported yet, plus enough RAM and storage, you're good to go. You can literally bring Windows gaming straight to your Android. How cool is that? All right, before we dive into the setup, let's make sure your device is ready to handle everything smoothly. Here's what you'll need. Processor. A Snapdragon chip is highly recommended if you want the best performance. RAM. At least 6 gigs. That'll keep your gameplay running nice and smooth. Storage. Remember, PC games can be huge. So, if you've got 256 gigabytes or more, you're in great shape. Once that's covered, you're ready to jump in. All right, now that you know what WinLater is and what you need to run it, let's move on to the fun part, installing and setting it up on your Android device so you can start playing Windows games. Step one, first things first, you'll need the WinLater APK file. Just head over to the official download page and grab the APK. Step two, once it's downloaded, go ahead and install it like you would any other app. If your phone pops up a warning about unknown sources, don't worry. Just head into your settings and enable installations from unknown sources. Super simple. Once that's done, you're one step closer to running your favorite PC games on Android. Once you've got WinLater installed, go ahead and launch the app. It might take a few minutes to get everything ready the first time you open it. That's totally normal. It's just setting up its environment. Don't worry, this only happens once during the initial setup, and after that, you're good to go. All right, next up, containers. These are super important because they're what actually let you run your Windows games. To create one, just tap the little plus icon up in the top right corner of the app. Easy as that. By default, the resolution is set to 800 by 600, and honestly, that works just fine for most games. But if you want that nice 16 by 9 widescreen look, try setting it to 960 by 544. It gives you better performance without really losing any visual quality. It's a great balance. Next up, let's pick a graphics driver preset that works best for your phone. If your device has an Adreno GPU, go with Turnip Adreno. If not, no worries. Just select Virgil Universal for all other GPU types. Easy. Now let's talk about the DX wrapper. This setting really affects game compatibility. For the broadest compatibility, go with Wine D3D. If you want better performance for Direct3D 9 to 11 games, pick DXVK. For Direct3D 12 games, VKD3D is your best bet. And if you're playing Command & Conquer titles, make sure to select CNC DDraw. Pick the one that fits your game, and you're all set. Under Wine Configuration, you'll want to set the video memory according to your phone's RAM. For example, if your device has 6 gigabytes of RAM, go ahead and set it to 6144 megabytes. This makes sure WinLater can use your phone's resources efficiently and run your games smoothly. 
In the Advanced section, you can tweak settings for Box 86 and Box 64 if you're planning to run specific games like Hollow Knight or Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Once you've got everything set up the way you want, just tap the check mark at the bottom right to save your container settings. And that's it. You're ready to roll. So what's next? Got everything set up? Awesome. Now it's time to add your favorite Windows games and take your Android gaming to a whole new level. If you're not sure how to add games, there's a dedicated guide that can help. With WinLater, you get the best of Windows gaming on your Android. No expensive gaming PC required. Got any questions? Drop them in the comments or reach out. And most importantly, happy gaming! Thank you for staying with me until the end of the video. If you liked this tutorial, don't forget to subscribe and like. See you in the next video.